Hello YouTube, my name is Gold and welcome back to another episode of Sub Machine Sunday. Today we will be reviewing the Spectre, which apparently stands for Special Executive for Counterintelligence, Terrorism, Revenge and Extortion. And no, I didn't know that from the top of my head, I just looked it up on Wikipedia, I'm not that smart. But this gun is pretty good though, it's uh, one of our favorite SMGs, it's definitely, actually it is our favorite SMG in Call of Duty Black Ops. Uh, we like the MP5K as well, but this gun is amazing, we think it can outplay the AK-47U at close range. And uh, it's pretty good with a grip and with a silencer and with a rapid fire, so it's a very versatile gun. And if you haven't checked it out already, then what are you waiting for? Hop on the PS3, but first, uh, watch this video because we took you know it took some time to make, but no, I I'm just kidding, you don't have to watch this, but it would be nice, um, because you are boss, but yeah, this is uh, as you can see, it, it, it bones at clones rage, really. I mean, um, you drop them very quickly. It's uh, it's just, and it has 30 bullets in a clip, which is which you don't see a lot with the SMGs in Call of Duty Black Ops, and um, yeah, so this is honestly, I love this gun. I've used it already a couple of times. In a free throw, you can't really show what it can do. It's very good in domination and team deathmatch. As a matter of fact, we have a team deathmatch game. We posted it a long time ago, like a 42 and two team deathmatch on Villa. I thought it was. Maybe you've seen it before, and maybe you can remember it, and you may remember that it was pretty good then and it's it, it still is it isn't patched or anything so yeah i mean it has every uh, sorry <laughs> it has everything an smg uh wants um okay maybe it doesn't have assault rifle power and uh you know a deadly rapid fire grip combo i i mean it has but it isn't that good with the rapid fire grip combo i tried it out um like the ak-47u has but it's still honestly I highly recommend it. It's um, so I guess I'll just uh, show you my favorite class setup with it right now, so you know what to use. And I mean, it's just a suggestion, though. I don't, uh, you know, if you have a better class, maybe leave it in the comment section, so maybe people will read it. I definitely will, and uh, I'll try it out. But yeah, so I would recommend this gun with a grip, as you see in this video, with uh, lightweight to get closer to the enemy because that's really good, and um, with. Slide hand pro because I don't see why you would use steady aim or anything. It's really good when you aim down the sights, and uh, with marathon because I think lightweight's kind of useless with, without marathon because you know you can only sprint for 10 meters or so, and uh, all the other stuff is just personal preference really because I mean in this game this is Astro's gameplay he used the Python dual wield I don't like this gun yeah, well dual wielded because I like to zoom in, uh, aim down the sights with it, and uh, yeah so that's all personal preference but. It's a really good with uh, lightweight pro and marathon um, pro because that way you can really rush with it and this is this gun is ex excellent for rushing I mean and it ha doesn't have a lot of recoil as well as you may saw right there it's just a uh, it, it goes up to the right I think a little or, or left and right I'm not sure so that's not that bad but I mean I would definitely give this gun a at least a 9 out of 10 and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video I really did um, I really do and I really did enjoy making the commentary because this is a, a pretty good gun oh no Kujo's coming up oh, what was that gun doing uh, gun dog dogs and guns I get yeah I confuse them sometimes because they look so much alike no just kidding but yeah I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up if you didn't please give it a thumbs down so we know you didn't enjoy it and please leave some constructive feedback when you do and as always, this has been Gold Wax, and yeah, I'll leave you with two more kills, I think. And, um, oh yeah, this is quite a, a funny ending, I thought. It's pretty weird. Look, he just stands there. But, um, and the last guy uh, falls into the last stand. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, and to all the new subs from um, the Commentator Wars contest, welcome. And yeah, guys, stay awesome and enjoy the bonus clip. Bye. Today's bonus clip is provided by Tony Montana or Scarface, who's a pretty good friend of ours, and he gets a very nice clip out here on Demolition on Jungle. So I hope you enjoyed. Bye.